Hey, what's up everybody? This is UD Scam. Today is Sunday, February 19th, 2017. It is 6.57 a.m. and it is day 42 of the 250K Transformation Challenge from Bodybuilding.com. So let's go ahead and do my weigh-in. So yesterday I weighed in at 144.6. Today I am 145.8, so that's a gain of 1.2 pounds. I was currently at 11.6% body fat. And today I'm at 11.9%, which is a gain of 0.3%. So for those of you just tuning in, today is day 42 of the 250K Transformation Challenge. Currently weighing in at 145.8 and 11.9% body fat. Actually good there. Go and take your hands, place them your sides here, like you're standing at attention. Kind of palms and thighs. There you go, that's good. You have to scoot to your right just a bit, right there. It's not quite that far, so bring it back just a little. All right, good. Let me see these legs right here. Right. Just pull them down there. The strap's gonna keep your legs in the correct position for the okay. entire test. Okay. Just gonna pigeon toe you just a little bit. There you go. And now we're gonna torture you. Yep. <laughs> Data. 50 shades of gray right here. <laughs> <laughs> Science, here we go. Right there. Same thing on the other side. Perfect. All right. So, we're going to start the test. It's going to take about five to ten minutes. Okay. I'll let you know when you can relax your arms. We're about halfway through the test. Uh, Janavan, last name? Yes. All right. What's up everybody? So this is my DEXA scan results from yesterday. And I'm currently at 16.7% body fat. My total mass is at 141.9 pounds. My fat mass is 23.7 pounds. My lean mass is 112. Bone is at 6.2%. Fat free mass is 118. BMI is 22.2 kilograms. And as you can see, they break it down into regions of my body. And my arms is what I hold the least amount of fat in, which is 11.6%. Uh, my legs is at 17%. My trunk, which is my shoulder area, is at 17.9%. The android and gynoid, which is the stomach and hips area, 15.9% and 16.6%. So these are pretty much all the numbers. Um, they even break down muscle mass between right and left arm. And my left arm does have more muscle mass than my right. Um, the guy said it was kind of weird since I am right-handed. So for some reason I favor my left side in the gym. And I actually know this because when I do bicep curls, my left side is way stronger than my right. And my right arm seems to give out faster than my left. I can pump out more reps with the left. Same thing with my legs. My left leg has more muscle than my right leg and um, it has less fat also. So this is basically one of the reports from the DEXA scan. I was surprised to see 16.7 percent. Um, the guy over there said that I was pretty athletic. I am in the category for athletic and that I shouldn't worry about anything. 
I did tell him I'm halfway through a transformation challenge. Um, a lot of people don't think I'm fat. However, I gain weight so rapidly and I lose weight rapidly that they just don't know. So here's one of the PDFs for my results and I thought this is actually interesting. This is my total body bone density. So they do a scan of my entire body and as you can see by the color coding, orange is where I'm lean, the white is the bones, and yellow is the fat. So I hold most of my fat basically in my shoulder area, in my stomach area, and in my hips area. And that's pretty much where my fat is. So when you look at me, you don't really notice it because um, it's nowhere else. My arms are pretty lean at 11%. 11 Everything else is between the 16 and 18%. So I always knew my stomach and my hips had it. I really wasn't aware that my shoulder area had a lot of fat. So this was very interesting to me. This is my resting metabolic rate. So a lot of times people use calculators. This actually is from the DEXA scan. So I burn around 1,469 calories per day. So if I did want to track my macros and I did want to count calories, I would be using this as my RMR. And so now I have a real good foundation of how many calories I need to take in or I need to take out if I'm trying to gain or lose weight if I was going by macros and calories. And a lot of people ask me what I eat or how do I count calories. I do not count calories for this transformation. I eat when I'm hungry. I'm currently doing keto, so that is high fat, moderate protein, low carbs. I do not worry about any type of calorie counting or macros. I just eat. I just try to stick in a lot of fat in my body. And whenever I'm full, that's it, I just stop. And if I'm hungry in three hours, I'll eat again. If I'm hungry in eight hours, I'll eat again. It's really that simple. I'm trying to make everything easy for me and I'm trying to make something sustainable that I can do long term. Here's an also another interesting stat, the body fat distribution analysis. So my android, which is my stomach area, the abdominal region, I'm at 15.4%. And it says, Ideally, the android fat tissue percentage should be less than total body fat percentage, which mine is at 16.7, so I'm good there. The gynoid is fat concentrated in the hips, upper thighs, and buttocks, and this is results that gives you that pear shape. I'm at 16.7%, and then the android to gynoid ratio, the ideal ratio is less than 1 for optimal distribution. I'm at 0.91. So my distribution rate is great. My Android region um, for body fat is where it needs to be. However, I am trying to go lower just so I can achieve that six pack look. So those were the results of my DEXA scan. I learned a lot. I now know where I hold all my body fat. Based off my scale and the test, 16.7% on the DEXA scan versus 11.9 on the scale. I'm gonna be doing a DEXA scan in about three months to see my results from today. Hopefully it goes down from 16.7%, which I know it should. And I'm just going to use this information. Um, it's going to motivate me to even drop my body fat more. Because I do have a lot of work to do. And we are halfway through the competition. There are six weeks left. So I really need to um, hit it hard. All right. Everybody have a great weekend. Have a happy Presence Day. If you have the day off tomorrow, I do. So see you guys all later. Peace. And this is me relaxed, and this is me flexed. Relaxed and flexed. If you have any comments, questions, or suggestions, leave them down below. Smash that like button, and don't forget to subscribe to my channel, Theo and